accept it and bring it to my people. Perfect, that's all I want. Okay. Um, if, if you could give me like a stamp copy. All of my people that I've been in don't feel safe. Please tell me you're not holding my property. I am. Well, Excuse we're trying me, to understand the situation. We're trying to understand the situation. Okay. You can step back right now. Step back away from us. Okay. So I'm not able to get any service to pay my bill. Um, are you okay waiting for a few minutes? We're I've already waited a few minutes. A few more security minutes. We're, a... I'm the security guard here. Um, we're actually having an issue with a couple people, um, and so I SPD is here. Um, and it has to do with um, our people, my like my people that I'm protecting, not feeling safe. So they they're not allowed. They're not able to do their jobs right now. Not feeling safe. Yeah. Because of, go? Uh, no, you're okay. You if if so you want to wait, they're not gonna. They're okay. not gonna I know. I read the problem not. for you. Okay. Um, if you want to wait and sit down, you can do that, or you could come back later. Problems. Yeah. Not so, helping problems are causing. Do you them. have? May I have your information? You know, I, again, it's, and that's sometimes. I mean, is that a joke? You're formally being trespassed. So oh, okay. It's not a joke. All right. The What's your first name? And the line says, you know, I don't like the way you treat my employees. Survey Raw here in Seattle with It's Just a Camera and Record America. We are at the Seattle City Light North Customer Service Center. And this video is a follow up on a video shot by Record America. See, they're very friendly out here outside of the customer service place. Hello, sir. How you doing? It was a weird day. A weird day. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't get any weirder. Um, do you know how to do a public records request? I don't know what that is. A public records request? Yeah. So you're asking... I'm asking for public records. You want our public records? Yeah, I want public... Well, ours. The public. Okay. I want you guys to provide me with public records, but some people aren't familiar about how to do that. So I'm just wondering if you are. Okay, well, I actually know how to do it. I've already filled out um, everything. So if I could, I'd love to just give it to you, and then you could forward it off to probably Seattle Municipal Tower or whoever. It's probably Seattle Municipal Tower because that's where everyone is in City Light. Right, so. yes. Um, Have you gone to the SMT? I haven't gone there for this request. It's probably best to go there since all their departments are there. This is mostly like for payment and construction. So. Yeah, um, so the reason I was asking about the public records law is because the Washington State public records law states that I can do the public uh, request at any location, at any office. Um, I have I, the. I'm not familiar with it, so if you don't like, I can Google it. Yeah, absolutely. Actually, um, you might want to. Here, here. So Washington Public Records Act. Here you go. The law of the state of Washington requires public access to all records and materials from state and local agencies. 
Yeah, so this is what you're looking for right here. So I can't see past the thing, but um, right here is the public records law, 4256 on the top, right? And that's, the, that's Washington Administrative Code, right? And so this, these are the codes that you would need to look up to find out. But actually, you don't need to do anything. All you need to do is take this from me, and then you send it to them. Send it to? To whoever you need to send it to, to Seattle City Light. Let's see, public records... City Light. I, I, I honestly do not know. <laughs> well, a lot of people don't. I mean, do you, do you know where to send it to from in City Light too, though? Well, you saying yes or no, though. Yeah, City Light has a has a records coordinator. Do you know who it is? I don't know who it is personally, like the name or anything. So, records coordinator for City Light. The reason why is because. Please understand, I'm just a cashier. I do not know anything about- I saw that it just said cashier right here. Do you need to- Oh, Yeah, I, I am a cashier. Okay. So I don't- I'm not a public records coordinator. Right. I hope you understand that. Yes, no, like, no, no, I understand. Okay. I'm just hoping you can just take this and give it to them. I would like to, but I want to make sure I know where to send it to and show you that I know where to send it because I don't okay. know where to send it to. All right. So Seattle Public Records Center for now. Yeah, um, know what you're gonna look, you're gonna be looking at the second one. So that's how all records are done through the city. You can do them on their website, but the state law also provides that you can do them in person at any office that might hold the record or any or any office that's a satellite of the main office. So that would be this, for example, the North Customer Service Center. I, I understand that you can give it to me, and I will send it off to someone. Yeah, but I want to make sure. Sure, you want to make sure that the right I, person. Yeah. I can send it to the correct person that you are telling me to send it to you. Yeah. It's not like you're just dropping off and not knowing where it's going to go to, right? Yeah, well, I mean, it's not on me to send it to the right person. I know, and it, I hope you understand it's not on me exactly right now because I don't know how. I understand, so yes. So if you give it to me, I want to know how to do it and show you that I know how to do it before I can send it. Okay. Sorry, it's just the way you presented yourself to me was a bit aggravated. Oh, how so? Um, just... The, the manner you presented to me, I just felt like I was you know, uncomfortable. I felt uncomfortable by how you presented yourself to me. Uh, well, you know, the reason <laughs> is sometimes is, is that when you go someplace to, to do things like this down here, most people don't know how to do it. And even public records officers don't know how to do it correctly according to the state law. And so when you come in, you kind of have to be prepared. You have to know what you're talking about, be a little assertive. Otherwise, you'll get turned away and denied. So... You said that you went to other public records services for City no, Light? No, service center is Officer White. How What's can that? I help you, Gates? You said you went to other public records services with City Light? Yeah, I've requested so, records um, with them before. I was before. Sure notified people. by Brennan Armstrong. Because I'm going to email this to them then. Uh, I was just yeah. Um, Do you know who those people are? Well, it's just the, it's just the department. The, the clerk it would probably be the city clerk. Um, so what, what was that city clerk's name? No. The city clerk of Seattle, whoever it is. Whoever the city clerk is that handles all the public records. Yep. So, City Light is under the city government. Oh, right. So, city government has like 26, 30 departments. Yeah. So, that's actually better to go to City Hall, wouldn't it? Where the Customer Service Bureau is, and that Customer Service Bureau would actually have yeah, more information. Yeah, it, it, so. it would be better to go to City Hall or Seattle Municipal Tower, and they would probably be able to handle the request better. Yeah. Than me, yes. Than you, yeah. She yes. Because I do not know. Okay, so all you have to do is just refuse to take the request, and I'll document that, and I'll be out of here. Am I supposed to do that? Why, why, why am I, are you telling me to refuse it? No, I don't want you to refuse it. I want you to accept it, according to the law that's written in, in okay. it. I can accept it and bring it to my supervisor then. Perfect, that's all I want. Okay. Um, if, if you could give me like a stamp copy or something like that. One moment. According to the law that's written in, in it. I can accept it and bring it to my Perfect, that's all I want. Okay. Um, if, if you could give me like a stamp copy or something like that. One moment. All right. So cute and so good. <laughs> this is probably not the best place to do the request. He's right, as you know. But. He's going to play a line. He's like, hurry up, man. I need to do this. I mean, if he, so if, keep he, he if he truly it. can't do it here and he can't accept it, that's fine. Yeah. I'll take it back. She just got a call from the other security. 
He's looking on Google to find out who the well, public. Now he's getting briefed by her. He's, she's telling him what to do. The security. Yeah. Someone sent her here, and the security guard on the gate to just call her to tell that we're here. <laughs> this is her little office. It looks like. Excuse me. I just want to. I just want to leave now. He's, he's, he's trying to be helpful. He just what he's trying to do. He doesn't want to be recorded giving you wrong information. Or right. Yeah. Job from. He's always scared. Yeah. That's why he's saying, I just want to make sure that I'm getting into the right person. Yeah. Well, I told him. I said, you know, the, you, you just have to accept it, and you send it, and you can give it to your supervisor, or whatever. Right. That's all you got to do. He's worried that it's going to show. You know. Oh, look at this. No, I'm I'm not trying to do that. Yeah. You know, I just want him to do it. That's what he's worried about. Yeah. Well, I'll just. I'll, I was like, wait, are you saying you don't? <laughs> I actually understand. He pre, he probably they probably don't normally accept them here. Unfortunately, they need to. Yeah, they just have to take it for you. Not a big deal. See, this is what the the Public Records Act is about. It's about the fullest assistance. Public employees providing the fullest assistance it to should, provide it should, access. It should be difficult. It should be, yes, we'll, we'll make sure it gets to the right person. Even if we don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Exactly. Yeah, that's what you pay us to do. That's what they should say, exactly. Yeah. Suggestions. Should I leave a suggestion? Maybe if you want to, yeah. You could say security guards shouldn't violate people's rights. Or to attempt to or call security the police. Security shouldn't violate people's rights and should smile more. She was right here, the same girl. Yeah. I didn't get a shot of her. Did she go back in there? Really? Yeah. She, she told me, nice to see you again. If, it, uh, if, if you're going to do that, make sure it's like really specific. Like, security guards should not interfere with for people's First Amendment rights. That way it's more specific. Yeah, that's good. Suggestions. Man, I'm about to just walk out of here and leave him with the request. He just took it, he accepted it. Security technically did. All right. I'm not interested what's going to come with a little meeting there. Phoenix security. So they called the police last time she was here, and th so she might be doing that again. Oh man! We need Enrique here to do his uh, his exclamation. Wow! Wow! You see that, guys? Oh! They just they just told me no to my request. You see that guy? Do more, do more. I was I've been telling her about this all the time. Every time we watch out, he said, "I'm just I'm just mad, mad, mad." Okay, I'm just gonna take off. I, I I'm not gonna wait for this guy, dude. I mean, it's taking too long. Just to. Yeah, she's calling. She's calling SWAT. Are you gonna keep your coat there? Or? Um, no, I think you can oh, go you ahead, ma'am. He was up there, but he's done. Okay. Who are you guys? We're just customers. We're just customers, oh, yeah. Oh, you got your cameras. <laughs> oh yeah, oh, yeah. You're yeah. Yeah. filming a, a video or something. Yeah. We just like to document our interactions with our public servants. So somebody's here, right? Yes, ma'am. He just went to add to get a question answered, I believe. Hopefully he comes back out. He's been gone for quite a while, though. We, didn't stump him with, we might have stumped him with our questions, so he could be... He could be a safe space. <laughs> oh. So what do you think? you think I should wait for this guy? Because he's not coming back out. He already took the request. Well... I think that she he, might have told he, him... Did he give you a receipt? No. I think you should have a receipt, otherwise how you know. You want to ask her since she's acting like she's the boss? Yeah. Like, excuse she's me, is he going to give you a receipt for that? Because you just told him to leave and then he hasn't yeah. come back. She's the boss, though. Yeah. I don't know. Obviously, she's not going to know, though. Yeah, but she but she can have him come back out because I think she's given him direct orders not to come back out. That's the problem. Oh, really? So she's actually interfering with business now by preventing the gentleman from doing his job. Oh, uh, I hope he comes back. Like, yeah, he's doing, looking if she comes back in, we can ask her. Yeah. The thing is, the cameras make them nervous because they don't really want accountability and transparency. You know, they they prefer that. But who's your organization? 
We're just citizens. We're just individuals. You're just citizens? Yeah. That comes with security. We should just go so she can get her service, you know? Here comes the security. Here comes the security. You can ask her. She needs service. Um, somebody will be out here in a couple minutes for you, okay? Thank you. 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 Did she say it was the same officer from the other day? I think so, yeah. Well, that's not good. Now, you know, if, if, if they don't want to accept their request, or they can't, I would totally understand. It's just they could tell me, and, I, and then I could take it somewhere else. Yeah, simple. That's pretty simple. I don't think uh, you're asking something really complicated. Yes or no? That looks like William H. Mason. Oh, my forearm is hurting, man. God, I'm getting arthritis in my hands. It's starting to sit in here. Look at that, it's a, whole, it's a whole huddle. How can we violate these people? What should we do? The back end of it, I had to tell my guy I'd actually go into back offices. Mm -hmm. um, but they were right up against the window, um, videoing, and uh, he stated that he didn't feel comfortable. He felt threatened by the way that they were kind of behaving and acting. Um, all of my people back there don't feel safe, they feel threatened. All of my people back there don't feel safe, they feel threatened. Um, and they want these people off our property. Okay. Um, they don't want them to come back. They cannot do their jobs um, when these people are here. Okay. Um, they, yeah, again, they don't feel safe. I mean, my goal is to keep my people feeling safe mm -hmm. um, and comfortable. Um, again, you were here yesterday. Right, right. You, you know, heard some of what happened, and then obviously she came back with two of her friends, um, males, bigger than her, mm -hmm. um, which makes my people feel even more uncomfortable yesterday. <coughs> Okay. So I'm not able to get any service to pay my bill. Um, are you okay waiting for a few minutes? We're I've already waited a few minutes. She's a a few more minutes. Guard. We're a... I'm the security guard here. Um, we're actually having an issue with a couple people. Um, and so SPD is here. Um, and it has to do with um our people, my like my people that I'm protecting, not feeling safe. So they they're not allowed. They're not able to do their jobs she right now. Not feeling safe. Yeah. Because of, go? No, you're uh, okay. If if so you want to wait, they're not gonna. They're I not know. I read that problem not. for you. Okay. Um, if you want to wait and sit down, you can do that, or you could come back later. Problems. Yeah. Now so, helping problems are causing them. Need to serve to help her because of their feelings. I, I, yes, I understand. You guys um, want to talk about why you're here? You know, I gave a, I gave a guy some of my some paperwork, and I just want a receipt for the papers that I gave, like a. You know, like a stamp date receipt. Oh, so you're not with. Well, we're all individuals. Yeah. But you're not here together. Uh, I need a receipt. Okay. The guy took my property and he went back in there. I just need a receipt for it or my property back. That's all I want. They have, they uh, just let you guys know you're being recorded. Okay. Uh, is there. Are you here for a reason, sir? Yes. What are you here for? Get access to any public information that has been. Okay, well, so if you're not I'm here for business for trespass, I didn't say that, sir. Well, I'm, I'm telling you that if you're not here for business, <laughs> big trespass. They have it. It's it's literally just in order to be trespassing on the property, they have to be a crime. They don't even need to. You articulate a crime, but you suspect it, Well, right now, you're not here for a crime. I felt really interested because it was right up against the wall. Sir, just because I didn't answer your question doesn't mean I might hurt your business. I don't think we should discuss it. Okay, well, the staff member's not wanting you here. Okay? And then, again, you cannot be trespassing on public property unless a crime has been committed. That is wrong. Yeah. No, it's not. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, my gosh. Yeah, you know. They don't have to be trespassing on the property. You want to get into a lawsuit? Yeah, let's get a supervisor. This guy's making false statements. Okay, good. Good. Yeah. You're talking about your butt right now. Yeah, let's, let's go. Hey, ma'am, if you could just ask him for a receipt, that's all we need to get out of here. It's just my property or a receipt for it. That's not my job, sir. Get the paperwork back. 
Right, but I mean, if, if it's a problem that we're here, why not just give me the, my paperwork and let me go, you know? Yeah, I don't know. It doesn't make sense, really. It's literally just one piece of paper. You can hand it back to me. She said base carrying the employees here. Base yeah. Care. So she's trying to protect. That's yeah. That's why they cannot help this lady. Yeah. Because they came a long way. I understand. I really have to we totally understand. We're on your side. I wish that they would help you. They're and refusing. I have a right to come here. You do. They're refusing your service. And they're breaking the law. I want to, ma'am. do their job. I want to, ma'am. That's what they're going to happen. outside. I don't want to they, see your faces. They're well, I'm sorry. I'm not going to do that. They're actually breaking the law by not no, helping you right now. No, you're breaking the law no, by we're not. preventing me from doing we're not what I need you from to do doing as a paying now. customer. You're the breaking employees the here you're are breaking the law by no, refusing to help you. No, you're preventing them from doing their no, job. No, not. I understand how you would feel that way, ma'am, but it's not true. People don't ever see the other side. We're customers. All you see is your He's a customer, ma'am. And if you would learn to see both sides of an he issue, gave up his position maybe so that you would could be, be a little bit more tolerant about what we have to do in this country He's to get along. He's a customer. Ma'am, I gave up my spot so you could go before me. You didn't give up shit. I did. That's your problem. You don't know how to give up and cooperate. You don't cooperate. Give up what? Well, we don't give up our rights. We don't give up we civil don't rights. Have rights to freedom. Freedom means oh. that you got to involve somebody else's freedom. Interesting. That's what freedom is about. No, the cops are here. They should help you. He's gonna make false statements. You better she record it. She made false statements. She did. Man, if you could just give me my request or a receipt, I'd be happy to ju just get out of here and let them violate me so this woman could get service. So simple. But I'm not going to let her deflect blame on us. It's, we're customers. We have a right to be here. We're not doing anything wrong. We're not breaking any law. It's sad she doesn't, she doesn't see. I'm, I mean, I'm trying to explain to her so simply. They're denying service to her. Jeez, man. I did not expect this. I thought that guy was seriously going to take the request. Because yesterday, yesterday, this guy helped her. Well, I don't know, man. The officer, is so, he's you're threatening to trespass. You want, you want your paperwork back or you want a receipt? That's that. I'm here exercising my first amendment right. That's my lawful reason to be here. They want to tell me I'm trespassing? I'll leave. Well, actually, you know, you're here with me, and I'm doing business here. That's right. We're all together. So we're allowed to wait. It's a public lobby. We're waiting for you to conduct your business. Why do I have to leave? Just without a camera? <sighs> man, what is wrong with these people, man? What's that? Hmm? What's that in his hand? Oh, it's the guy with the beard who said that. But you see, he has that paper. He doesn't have my public records request, does he? Please tell me you're not holding my property. I am. Uh, well, we're trying to understand the situation. Okay. You can step back right now. Step back away from us. So. Yesterday, they didn't, she didn't have this guy has custody of my property. They so, gave him custody uh, of my property. Anyway, so, yeah, trying to Officer figure White. out what they were doing here yesterday. She didn't have any business. So, they came in today, uh, with three of three them total, with this piece of paper. He couldn't find anything regarding this, and the only thing the gentleman was saying that um, he wanted public records. Okay. So, when he Googled this, he couldn't find anything. Okay. And so then when he tried to speak with him, he became more confrontational and put the camera up into the uh, closer to the glass. And so now the staff members feel uncomfortable. So they're kind of in the back right now. Mm -hmm. This uh, guy just articulated being a witness to a false so, report. Anyway, no, no, no threats were made. Um, when I asked if they had any business, the gentleman that's currently in there wouldn't answer me. He said that he was here for this, but they're trying to figure out exactly what this is, which is why they gave it to us. All right. I was giving it to you to see if you might know what it is. It's in the first sentence what it is. Do they have a PDR request program? I don't think so. I'm not sure. And the 
deploy the asphalt brothers. I'm not sure about that as well. Try not to block the door. You know? Yeah, yeah. I'll check with you. Um, you just, we have any other crimes? Just trespassing right now. Yeah. Um, but, what's, uh, the what's, what's the company? Uh, I'll speak. I'll see what they want to do. Um, I know I the dealt with her yesterday. The head of security is actually coming here right now. Okay. And he's like 10, 15 minutes away. Okay. And um, I wrote a report for the incident with her yesterday. Okay. Um, so. Was we, she trespassing yesterday? She was not. Because um, okay. at the time I spoke with her, I didn't know if there was a crime. But okay. when I came in here, spoke with her, she had already left. Okay. Um, so that's where we're at right now. Okay. So. Are you going to keep possession of my property? Uh, yes, sir. All right, so I'm considering this a detainment since you're holding my property. You're free to leave. I'm free to leave without my property? You're free to leave. Nobody's detaining you. He's holding on to my property. Is that the property you handed over to City Light? Yeah. Okay. And they handed it to you or to somebody? Custody is in City Light. Okay. The custody is with the person who has it. Yeah. That's what custody means. Yeah. Right. And the officer has it. He's holding it. He does it. have it. Right. He doesn't He's trying to understand what your call. position is and what you guys want because you guys aren't forthcoming with the information. Sir, please, you've been here the whole time. If you could just de escalate the situation and tell him what I said earlier. Right. But I think what he's trying to explain is that you released custody to City Light. Uh, that's so it, fine. So they can have theirs, it. They can have it. But they're asking for our help. We have to come to a 911 call. Prior. Sure, sure. So that's what we're doing now. The officer you gave it to City Light, he is representing city light in the sense that he's trying to help them yeah i don't think they understand your request and and we haven't gotten answers did you, did, did you see the paper oh you but, didn't read but, it okay but they know what i said is i don't think they understand it that's oh. who you came to for help right not us so i don't think they understand your request and when they couldn't figure it out they called us you know i told I them know, we're going to figure out here i told them i said if, if 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 you can accept this request if you then accept it and i just want a receipt and i'll be on my way or if you can't accept it, just say, we can't accept this here, and I'll just take it and be on my way. Okay. And, and, that's and then the guy left the counter, and then the police arrived. Okay. And I, I'm going to tell you right now, some people are intimidated. But, so the fact that you guys were filming them, you may have, it's perception. You're not, I'm not, I wear one every day, you're carrying one. We're not, but some people are. They're like, what, why am I? Did I do something wrong? Right. He, so I, he so expressed I, that to me, and I told okay. him, you know, and... So he probably got nervous and... The thing that the other officer said here about me becoming aggressive, putting the camera closer, it's all made up. Well, and that's what I'm saying, but it's his perception. Maybe he perceived you were being more aggressive, the, 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 the employee. He did. He said, he said something about, you know, I didn't really, I was put off or something by the way you approached. There you go. Except, except my approach was very polite, it's just the camera, you know, like you said. Like I said, yeah. yeah. It's perception of what, what was occurring. Yeah, and so. I'm glad you, got, you guys in first laws, not feelings and perception. Right. So right. right. And that's exactly what we, and that's, a lot of people don't understand that because yeah. they want us to do more when we can. Yeah. So, so you know, ri really what I want is it, if, they, if they accept the paper, you see, they took the paper behind the thing saying that they weren't going to accept it. So you, I, I know you were saying, I released custody. I was giving it to him to look at it. But he took it, and he's saying that he can't accept it when he took it to the back. The security, the female security who was here, right. she was here yesterday when she was here trying to change her, her address. Okay. And uh, she, I think she went and talked to the guy and told him, don't provide service. Hmm. Um, I think that's what's going on. Is that right? Because yeah. I didn't see that so part. So I came here, and the security saw me, and she called the cops before I got service. So I did get service, and okay. I left the building. The cop came. I think it's the same guy that I was here. Okay. Yes, he told me that I couldn't be here, that he would trespass me, they wanted to trespass me, but I was free to go, so I left. Okay. Well, as long as you're not on their property, um, then that's fine, okay? Okay. All right. The, the city of Seattle property. Yes, yeah, city of Seattle property. So I cannot be on the city of Seattle property. If you're not here if to conduct business. They've asked you to leave. Yeah. Perfect. You still holding on to my property? Yes, sir. I'm trying to figure out what the business is. That is the thing is, sir. I'm. F I think you were here already, and I already explained this to you. I just want a receipt. If they can accept it, then I'll be on my way. Or if they can't, I'll take it back and I'll be on my way. What kind of receipt are you wanting? Just a receipt that they received it. You just want a receipt that they received it. Yes. That's what I've been saying for the last well, 20 minutes. A dated huh? sign or they can give it back to me. Okay. And I would just get out of here just because I want this lady to have service, you know? Yeah. So they're not going to take it. Is that why you're... Well, I, they don't understand what you are requesting. Even though it says in the first sentence. The public uh, disclosure? 
This, the request. following request is being made pursuant to the Washington State Public Records Act, RCW 4256, at okay. sequential, Chapter 4414, the Washington Administrative Code, entitled Public okay. Records Act Model Rules of the Washington State Administrative Code. I am requesting the fullest assistance to inspect and obtain copies and or information about public records, number one through three, enumerated below. This is very easy to understand. All right, well, this is easy to understand. This is a payment center. Okay, right. if you want a public disclosure request, you need to go downtown and address it with them. Okay, this is just a payment center. They don't have Right, so what is all this about? Uh, you guys being confrontational with the cameras. Oh, you're the witness to the false report. Who reported that to you? Who reported what? You said I was being confrontational and I was aggressive. That's what you were saying earlier. Oh, I was saying that you were being confrontational. And aggressive, you In said. In their words. Yeah. In their words. That's how they right. So in that case... Um, and, then, and then also, you guys have caused customers to become upset and leave. No, we have. Um, yeah. She was upset because she didn't receive service. Okay, well, I think she was kind of upset towards you guys and asked, even specifically told you, why are you doing this? You're just causing more problems. Is that not correct? And someone should have let her know that it's the employees refusing uh, uh, to help her, no, not I'm us. Talk, I'm talking to her, okay? So you've that, got a that's... lot of bad information, McElroy. No, I don't. How is it that you write police reports and arrest people and you're so ill-informed? How am I ill-informed? Everything you've just said in the past five minutes has been BS. You threatened to now, trespass no him from here. You threatened to trespass him from here. You've been sir. No, I, I have not. Yes, you yes, have. Yes, you have. I think I'm being reasonable. You know you're not. To so put him in a cage as confrontation. Now that you have you your forms, forms and you have and no, other, put me in a cage no other business here, for no crime committed, you're free to go. They want you guys trespassed from the property. Um, unless you guys have business to conduct, which you were this here yesterday. This is our business, sir. I don't think yeah. you Again, have any you're business. showing your ignorance. The First Amendment of the Constitution is our business. We don't need any other business. That's where you're so ill-informed. You're on private. You need to train this man, you're sir. They're not ill-informed. They look like a jackass. They're ill making ill you look like a jackass. They have no integrity in their oath. The That's what it is. They don't so care like about the law. They don't care about the Constitution. I don't want to hear what he has to say Why are we talking to this guy? He doesn't know what he's talking about. You're on he should property. not be right. the contact right. officer. You're right. Don't you're talk right. to this guy. You're wasting your time. He's a moron. What should we do from here? If you got your paperwork back, we can leave. Let's We're done that. with our audit. Let's go. Let's go. They're not going to help us. Please retrain him, sir. You're He's being making the entire Salise Police Department look bad. You're being trespassed from the property. You're if, being trespassed if you return, from the property. you will be subject to you arrest. Return, you will be subject to okay. arrest. I just want and you guys to understand that. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do will be held against you in the court of law. Let me see your hands. Take your hands out. It's your not okay to conspire with other pocket, city agencies sir, to okay. deny civil rights. You're still on private property. It's not okay to conspire with sir, other city agencies to deny civil rights. Parole. You're still on private property. Are you on parole, sir? Private property owned by the city? Yes, sir. Let's go, guys. How's that? Well, yeah, it's owned by the Seattle uh, city of Seattle. But you're not here to conduct business no longer. So you're not allowed to be here. So you are, you've been told to leave. Okay. Um, I can't say why they have. May I have your information? And that's sometimes. I mean, is that a joke? You're formally being trespassed. So oh, okay. It's not a joke. All right. What's your first name? You want my ID? You're going to have to take it. Okay. Well, you're still on private property. Okay. Why asking you're still on private property. You just have no further business being here. They don't want you here on this property. Okay? Mm -hmm. They refuse service here. If you don't leave, we will be arrested. Well, we're going to leave. We're leaving because you guys are threatening to arrest us. Yeah, because you're, you're trespassing. Okay. We're not trespassing. Yes, you are. You're trespassing right now. You're what? asked to leave. You're still here. And you've been getting your forms back now that we figured out what all that was? You held on to my property for all this time. You unlawfully detained me by holding my property. And now you're telling me that I'm free to go and I'm going to be trespassed? We're trying to figure out what the issue is. Okay. So that's why we were looking at the forms. You, you think okay, it's okay for them to pass we're, you we're my done. property? We're done. If you don't leave, you'll, you're subject to arrest for trespass. Okay. You've been told to leave multiple times. You can either leave or you can go to jail for trespass because you have been told to leave um, all right your own private problem by the people they told yes. us to leave they told me to tell you because you're so confrontational with them that they feel harassed so they wanted me to relay that message to you i can accept it and bring it to my supervisor perfect that's all i want okay um if if you could give me like a stamp copy or something like that so, would you be willing to come out to the sidewalk with me so we could file a, a report for the false report? If you want to you? file anything, then you can stand on the sidewalk and I'll be up there. But as long as you're off the private property, we'll 
address okay. that. Well, I have no problem leaving, just like I said before. Okay. If you get my property. All right, well, we're, we're asking you to leave. So go ahead and leave. Okay. Bye. All right, come on. Let's go. Go ahead and leave. Let's go, Lee. I'm coming. Yeah, she's coming. I need to get these guys' IDs. I got their vehicles. We know where the call came in. It won't be hard to track them down. I just say we go before they pull up this bullshit. He just threatened to arrest us. Exactly what I'm saying. We just need to go. You got your paper back. Because they're pissed now. I called them out. So they're going to try and do something. What are you doing? I do not know. I told her to come. She's getting a card. Shitty police, man. The worst. The worst. They don't even know the law. They don't know anything. They threaten trespass from Seattle City Light. It's always the short guys, too. 